here is our transfer. Oh my god, how hot is it? <laughs> oh yeah, yeah, yeah. Literally is super hot. It's a scorcher, that's for sure. We are in Rhodes or Rhodes. Ro Look at this, Rhodes. Ro Ro Oh my god, it's so hot and I'm in Jorgens and I need to get out of them. I know, it was literally, we were literally in and out, super, super speedy. And then even um, our taxi, taxi was just waiting and ready with our names. We got a little private minibus um, because it's just quicker right. and easier. Hello. Okay. You want that? Oh, it's Eden Rock Resort. So that's where we're staying. Eden Rock Resort in Rodez. We actually saw it from the plane. I look a state. Sorry, I keep looking at myself in the viewfinder because I look so bad. Um, but yeah, Eden Rock Resort. We saw it from the plane and it looks stunning. Um, the pool is very much recognizable, which is why we saw it. 36 degrees. And it's staying like this all week long. can tell I'm just super duper chilled right now so chill I have not stopped sweating guys we are finally checked in and there's a bit of an issue with the rooms so Lee and Ash are literally waiting for their room to be ready it's like over an hour behind now so they're just chilling with us but yeah off to a bit of a rocky start but we need a drink it is ridiculously hot craig i think you should take this coke because we don't want no sakaya setting up the <laughs> honestly it is hot it's so hot i've not even been able to take any pictures any videos nothing i've literally just oh, been look what oh is that an aircon yeah we need that we need one of those Hey guys, can you hear that? That's actually scaring the life out of me. If I see any bugs, I am going to freak the <laughs> out. Yeah, the grass is too high. Oh my god, I, yes, I'm one of those people. Yeah. Can you hear all of those bugs? They sound mammoth. <laughs> It is day two. It's day two. I feel like yesterday I didn't really vlog much because look, there's an echo here. Anyways, didn't really vlog much because just a lot was going on. We were trying to find our bearings. We've actually moved rooms because our aircon in the other room wasn't working after I had unpacked and everything. We literally had to move really late last night to a new room because it was literally unbearable. Even the aircon in this room is still not that great because the room's set up in like two areas they've only got one aircon pointing over like the lounge area and it is just not doing justice to like where we actually sleep so i thought i would show you guys our new room seeing as we literally like the room yesterday was such a mess because i don't know why but they did they had like a cot made up um like almost like four people were going to be sleeping there and yeah it was just the two of us so not sure why they did that but we've got so much more space now much prefer this room and our balcony is absolutely huge one thing i will say is all the rooms at this resort seem to be like quite dated compared to like the main areas the restaurants the bars they're all really really nice and refurbed and super modern but then like the room so it must be like quite an old hotel where they've just like started refurbing um 
the main main areas because the main areas are so nice um, but I just find like the bedrooms are just not because this is meant to be a five star resort now I feel like five stars in Europe and five stars in somewhere international are just two totally different things but I think that's purely because a lot of places in Europe um, the establishments have been around for so long that they all do need some kind of refurbishment to keep up with the times but anyway here is our room i will literally start from our front door so as you walk in this is the view and we've got loads of storage and then this is the kind of like loungy area so these rooms are called bungalow rooms and i genuinely had a long chat with craig yesterday i was like why is it called a bungalow but there's this like really long seating area uh, loads of pillows and then they've got this chair so we've literally unpacked everything over here so i can see everything and don't miss anything um and then to the left we have the bed area honestly one of the most uncomfortable beds i've ever slept on in my life it is so hard that's all i'm gonna say and it makes loads of weird noises like when you turn around so craig's got all his stuff on that ledge the tv that the bed sorry does not face the tv which i find very very weird why is the tv over here and not over there but anyways and then over here oh there we go he's, he's showing you guys the noise this isn't like a bad review or anything it's just what we're experiencing so the bathroom's like super super dated um hello we're in my chocolate tube from the plt hall i should say um huge mirror we've got all of our little bits and bobs on the side that you get um the bathroom is actually not that bad compared to the first room the first room the bathroom was awful but this one kind of just works so we didn't actually have cold water in the first room that we were allocated until later on which was really really weird because i had a shower straight after you know when you get off the airplane and you just need a shower the water was hot and i forgot to mention that at the minute we are experiencing oh there we go better lighting um so at the minute Rose is experiencing a heat wave so our phones went off really really early this morning like i thought it was the fire alarm i'll show you guys a message on the screen like what popped up on the phone but it was like emergency alert woke us up in a panic because it sounded like a fire alarm but it was basically and it's not even in english i actually can't read it basically don't do anything to start fire so it is so hot here guys the temperature is 37 degrees so i've literally gone in the shower this morning with my swimwear to keep me a bit cooler my hair on this trip i generally don't think i'm going to be able to wear down because it's just too hot and yeah don't want to complain that it is so hot but geez it is hot um but yeah i definitely don't want to complain because i know we're not going to have like consistent heat like this but there's currently a heat wave here so didn't we time that so right lee and ash are coming to see our new room anyways i'll show you guys the balcony i haven't even seen it myself but because I don't really want to go out there and let the heat in. How do I open this? Oh, I don't even know how to open it. But I don't know whether you guys can see. That is how big our balcony is. But I would absolutely just burn on this balcony. So I'll probably have to just show you guys that another day. When it's like sunset and chilled and windy and we can saying chilled and windy fingers crossed to get chilled and windy uh, so let's see maybe in the evening we can go out there i'll definitely be taking some content out there at some point so thank you oh thank you can i get some icy water as well i love that ice day oh my god it's like lukewarm I feel like we're like off i feel like it's <laughs> I need ice for that. But I love that I stay drinking Prosecco even on holiday. Icy water. Thank you. Thanks. I'm gonna have to use an ice cube for my Prosecco because it's warm. Uh, don't they know ice is life? Especially during a heat wave. Here you come, Lee. Oh, here you come. So Lee went to get cash out so we can play, play. Lee went to get cash out so we can do some water sports. We're gonna play. Kind of yeah, cool. we're gonna play in the, in the water. 
but it's gonna have to be ideally when the sun goes down a little bit because we're gonna burn up. <laughs> So we're heading on one of these things and not gonna lie I'm a bit nervous because we just had lunch. Obviously I'm not gonna be able to take my camera on this sofa thingy. Um, I don't even know how long it's on for but I'm not gonna risk taking my camera out there so I will have to let you guys know how it goes if I manage to stay on the entire duration. So let's see. A few moments later. So, um... so sadly couldn't vlog on there because obviously I didn't want my, to lose my camera. But we just went on the big sofa thingy. Can you see it in the back? That thing there. And it was, oh my God, so much fun. Do that if you want to go faster, which these two were like rinsing. Ash and I were literally just screaming for our lives. So my throat kind of hurts as well. Um, but yeah, it was fun. Sorry guys, my battery, my my SD card was full. Couldn't get my words out there. My hair looks crazy because obviously the wind on that ride was just crazy. And forgot to mention, we're at an all-inclusive resort. So um, all of the food and drink in this video, we literally have included in our stay. So um, they've got tons of a la carte restaurants. That you have to book prior to come in and there's one japanese like temp teppanyaki restaurant that we were trying to book onto but we've not been able to squeeze in before the end of our stay which really really sucks um but the boys have gone to get us some drinks and i'm gonna i literally asked for icy water because it is so ridiculously hot and i literally can drink like the entire sea of water right now i'm so thirsty and i've been staying thirsty on this trip um so yeah we're doing that and we're waiting for our drinks unlimited cocktails um and yeah they've got loads of different types of cocktails so the drinks menu is muy bueno we're not even in a spanish country but i keep talking spanish <laughs> really windy all of a sudden yeah I think that's where like all the entertainment and stuff is by the pool during the day anyway um, we did go by the baby pool today like the smaller pool there's a big pool and small pool and I accidentally broke my Prosecco glass so yeah not good I almost felt like everyone at the pool's eyes on me when I broke it. So far it's been so nice just to relax and chill and switch off. I've literally got all of my WhatsApp groups on mute because I'm like, I don't want to talk to anyone, okay? I don't want to talk to anyone. I need to show you guys the view. It's actually stunning. So, so stunning. There's the stunning view. Pointing it at you, Craig. <laughs> um, but yeah. Here it is. So pretty. So that's the small pool where, where I broke the glass and then the big pool is behind me. I feel like we still haven't really explored the hotel that much. Like I feel like there's loads around that side that we can still explore and work out what's going on. So what I didn't know was that currently in Rhodes there is um, the first heat wave since like 1987 or something like that. Uh, 34 years ago. Yeah, so basically Rhodes has their first ever like heat wave since 87 and it's created loads of like forest fires and stuff like that. So we've actually witnessed today that this giant helicopter um, coming around to the front of the like the beachfront and 
picking up water from the sea in like this huge hose it was actually unreal i filmed yeah it literally was something out of a movie it was so weird it looked like this giant like robot in the sky um i did take a video of it it's not the best video and i feel like the video doesn't even do it any justice whatsoever i kid you not every single person on the beach literally was just like in shock they honestly couldn't believe what they were witnessing it was a bit scary as well because we were actually in the water at the time and i was just thinking like if this helicopter crashes we are all gonna die like i don't know why i think so like extreme but all I kept thinking was like I think I just watched too many movies but that's all I kept thinking but I'll insert a video to show you guys what it looked like honestly it honest doesn't do it any justice whatsoever and I had to zoom in a little bit so the quality isn't gonna be that great but yeah so we did that today we we went into the beach had a really really lovely swim the water is incredible we went to lunch we did a a la carte lunch at a seafood restaurant I had mushroom risotto though. I'm not the biggest seafood person, but I just wanted to try one of the a la carte restaurants. Craig had salmon, looked incredible. Actually tasted incredible. I had a little bit of Craig salmon. Um, yeah, I had the mushroom risotto. I had calamari to start and then a baklava for, for dessert because I absolutely am obsessed with baklava. Um, so yeah, guys, that's a little bit of a check-in at what's going on at the minute. We are, what time is it? So we're at day two, five minutes to six, and we are actually waiting for Lee and Ash because we need to go to reception to book our PCR test for tomorrow. We have to take a PCR test three days before our flight, our return flight, so we need to do that. I'm genuinely, I'm so nervous because I feel like I've made it through the entire pandemic without having to do a PCR test, and now I have to do one, so. I'm nervous I'm not gonna lie I've only done lateral flow once but I've done it myself so I pretty much can decide how far that thing goes up my nose and I can't in this instance so wish me luck please I'm gonna need it <laughs> Craig's like let me get on first because I had a really bad experience last time <laughs> do you want to go in the middle Okay, it's a bit of a squeeze, yes. yeah. Ooh, what are you doing? <laughs> <laughs> oh, that's good. Oh, that's good. Oh, that's good. Oh, that's to the person that you think will become a millionaire one day. You know who that is? It's, it's already happened. <laughs> Pass the camera to the person who should be in Baywatch. <laughs> <laughs> I've never seen Craig that far. <laughs> so, um... I need to explain what so happened in the upgraded. last... Yeah, Craig's been drinking as you can tell. Wait, I think we go this way now. Okay. Yes, yeah, this way now. So we're in the nicer side with yeah. like the residents basically. We're in the um, Chelsea of We're in the Chelsea of <laughs> our hotel. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> um, but yeah, we basically because we had like the room situation, we 
See, I thought those were going to be our rooms over there. Oh, you're joking. Over there, like the garden view. Um, but yeah, because we had the issue of our rooms, uh, the supervisor called and was like, oh, can you come see us? And we were like nervous, like, what have we done? going to take the free wine as a <laughs> yeah, Lee thought because they left like a fruit platter and wine in each of our rooms that that was the compensation. So we were like, no, actually, wow. did I get that? No, I didn't. Wow. Ash just tripped that, stacked it. Don't hear a shot. It's because it's kind of flat footage, you know. I can't. I don't know what's happening. Right, Hugo. Huh? Oh, no. Oh, Craig, you I'm can't say that. I'm not oh, he's, he's the moment we're cutting out. Craig's trying to get cancelled on the YouTube channel. Oh, they're going to cancel Craig. Oh, he's the moment we're cutting out. That's going to go trending on Twitter. Cancel Craig. <laughs> <laughs> no. Um, oh, look. Look at this. What's that? What's that thing? What's that? It's a lime, no? It's a lime. Oh, it's a lemon. Lemon. Yeah. Don't pick it, Seth. I'm just sitting there talking out. You were like, oh, no lamb for your tequila? Wait, I'll come back. <laughs> so yeah, guys, we spoke to the supervisor who said, oh, we're so um, sorry you weren't happy with the service. And just like, I guess they just wanted to compensate us for not being able to, oh, the guys had to wait like an hour and a half for their room to be ready when we had already checked in. So first she offered us free massages, but we already booked massages for this trip. I love that this woman already got her, bought her tennis kit. <laughs> um, yeah, my hair keeps blowing up. Yeah, there's like a tennis court just there. How cool. Um, so yeah, basically they upgraded us to the green wristband, which means that, oh, so we go right. So it means we get access to a whole different section with like premium yeah. drinks and stuff like that. We didn't even know this place existed to be honest. Oh, no, it's that way. Three hours later. <laughs> Knocked out before we even started the game. Let's not lose this table. Yeah. Yeah. Huh? I'll go first. <laughs> That's my man. <laughs> 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 yeah. Are we playing with the same guys as this or what? Uh, yeah. What happens now? Stop the game to get a massage. It's not a massage, it's a game. Get the binoculars. I'm joking. <laughs> it looks like you're being born again. <laughs> you're in the womb. Yeah. What? Yeah. Yeah, there's a COVID hug. <laughs> <laughs> I love the descent, it's like taking you back. Has it like squeezed your legs again? <laughs> Thank you. 
Larry. Uh-uh. He always pipes up. You've got Larry. 